Hi Alexis, this is Walter from the Domain Corvallis, and I just wanted to first off start off by apologizing. Um, so yesterday I was really, really sick, and I'd put your tour in our calendar, but unfortunately I put it at 8 a.m. when nobody was in at work, so that was my mistake. And I just wanted to apologize and let you know that your time is extremely valuable to, to us, and I just hope you can see that. Um, I'm gonna record what the tour would have been, that way you can see the property and you can see you know, everything that we have here to offer. So yeah, so I'm gonna start off. Um, actually right now we're in our clubhouse, which is open 24 seven. Uh, we do a lot of resident events in here and you can kind of see um, there's a lot of places to hang out. There's a pool table and all those sorts of things. So we start off over here. Here's actually the entrance to our front door. Um, you walk in here, you have a magnetic key that can let you in at any time. And then our front office is just over here to your right and to your left is our Amazon hub where you will be, uh, all your packages will come in, you'll get an email or a text, and you'll just have to put your code in right here, and then one of these uh, storage lockers will open. So yeah, it's pretty handy. I live here myself, I love it, because I can come and get a package whenever I need to, no matter the time. So like I said, over here is our front desk, and then over here, you can move in. We actually have a 24 seven vending market, so it kind of has all the necessities, Toilet paper, paper towels, toothbrushes, Advil, Tide Pods, shampoo, conditioner, anything you can really think of. And then it also has a little bit of a snack section, just in case you know you don't want to run to the grocery store, but you're a little bit hungry. And then vending as well, like more snacks. And then this is kind of like our drink vending machine. So, and it's really, really nice because it's all through the system. You can put your wallet, you can put your credit card on, and all you have to do is use your thumbprint, and then you're good to go. So... Yeah, pretty handy. It's kind of nice, especially if you know, you're know you coming for a midterm or you're studying or something like that and you just really don't have the time to go somewhere. It's just right there, right easy for you. So now we're heading upstairs, which is, upstairs is probably my favorite part because just like you, you know, I'm extremely busy and I really need a nice place to study. And so up here, this is kind of our study lounge. We have free printing at all times. Uh, this is black and white. If you need color, we have that down in the office and that's free as well. And then here we have our computer lab. We have five MacBooks on this side and then we have six Windows computers on this side. So kind of whatever your preference is, we have it for you. And then here's kind of my favorite part. Uh, we have study rooms that you can reserve and use for any uh, projects. They have smart TVs, where you can hook up your laptop to and put any of your projects or presentations up, which is really, really nice. So we have these where you can come and study alone. And then we also have a lot bigger of a conference room, which is also really nice. Let's say you're working on a group project or you just need a little bit more space to kind of lay everything out. We have that right in here. So it's really nice. Um, we have all of these charging ports so you can plug in your computer. We also have ethernet. That way you can connect directly to our Wi-Fi at almost all our study stations, which is also pretty convenient. That way you have fast Wi-Fi. So yeah, this is probably one of my favorite sections. And then my most favorite section is actually where we're going to going into now, which is our gym. Our gym is two stories, state of the art gym. Our top story is kind of our cardio, which is really nice. We have everything from stair steppers, ellipticals, treadmills, and we have bicycles over there. And it's kind of nice whenever you're running or using the ellipticals. You have a really nice view of the pool. And I'll show you that a little bit later. But it's really nice because it's always nice to look at something pretty when you're working out. And then also on our top floor of our gym, we kind of have a hit room, which is high intensity, which is really nice. Uh, I like this room a lot because I don't like doing regular cardio, but this is kind of where I live because it's got anything you can think of. It's got more advanced elliptical and treadmill. It's also got a scale. And then also anything you can think of, punching bag, weighted medicine balls, rowing machine, another elliptical slash bike, and then a bunch of different cardio machines, things like that. So yeah. Not too bad, and it's also nice, especially when it's really nice outside. Uh, these bicycles, you can actually wheel them out and take them out to the fitness room. You can take them out over here onto this patio. 
You can ride outside when it's nice. You get a nice cool breeze. So, not too bad. And then also out here, we also have a sand volleyball court and ping pong and horseshoe. It's also really nice in the summertime. It's just starting to get used now more with the social distancing stuff, easing up a little bit. We're able to open part of our gym, not the top part because the treadmills are too close, but everything should be opening up pretty soon. And now we move downstairs to our weight portion of the gym room. We have dumbbells, free dumbbells, all the way up to 100 pounds, curl dumbbells, and then kettlebells, and a bunch of different machines that are very good to use. Um, yeah, so kind of get a nice view of everything here. I quite like it myself. I went from a lot bigger gym than here, um, and I came to this one, and I was a little hesitant at first, but it's really nice because it kind of has every single necessity that you need, but it's never crowded and you can use it 24 seven and you don't have to pay for gym membership, which is also a great, great plus. So now once we leave our gym, we have a drinking fountain and two bathrooms right outside. That way it's very easily accessible. And now we're back in our clubhouse. And now we're gonna be moving into kind of a multi-use area, which is really nice. As I pointed out earlier, we have our pool table. But then we also have, which is probably one of our most popular amenities, is our Starbucks coffee machine maker. You can make chai, chai lattes, tea, coffee, hot chocolate, whatever you want, all based from Starbucks. And then also what a lot of the residents don't know is we have an ice machine right down here. So you can make iced coffee, which is also really nice. And this is other, another multi-use room that a lot of our resident events uh, take place in. So you get to meet a lot of people and see a lot of things. And then we come outside and you can see how large the pool really is. It's actually the largest outdoor pool in Corvallis. So we have over here, a little cabana with some TVs, great for lounging. You can see our general manager in over there. She's putting that to good use. And then I don't know if you can see, but on this far side, we have barbecues that are always available for use as well. And then this over here to our left, it's actually probably one of the most used amenities as well as a coffee maker. It's our multi-use turf field. So we have hammocks, lawn chairs. We have a fireplace. I don't know if you can see it, but it's over there where those wood chairs are at. And then more hammocks. It's really nice because rain or shine, this is always open. You can always use it, which is really nice. So now we're going to be walking over here. Um, this is at first the model unit I am going to show you is our three bedroom. I know you're interested in the two bedroom Alexis um, and this, we don't have any two bedrooms to currently show, but this three bedroom is basically identical to our two bedroom. I'll just show you the one small difference. So coming in, like I said, you have an electronic key. It opens all the doors that you need, your bedroom door, clubhouse door. Um, gym doors, everything like that. So now, coming in, this would be what you'd walk into. Unfortunately, it does not come with the bike, but all first floor apartments do come with a nice bike rack. And then we walk in here. Like I said, everything is fully furnished, so everything you see here, you're gonna get. All stainless steel appliances, their own ice maker, stainless steel dishwasher, oven, microwave, anything you can think of. It's gonna come with this island, these four stools, this couch, coffee stool, uh, 50 inch TV, TV stand, love seat, and side table. So all this furniture is included, which is really, really nice. Also, like I said, water, uh, sewage, Wi-Fi cable, all is included in the price. Now, here's the only difference from the two bedroom. So we have one bedroom over here and we have two bedrooms on either side. The only difference in a two bedroom is this would be walled off. And then all you would have over here is your own individual washer and dryer, which makes a huge plus for all our units because they all have an individual washer and dryer. So I'm just gonna, gonna go ahead and show you one of the bedrooms. All of them are identical. 
We start off, like I said, you get your own bed frame and mattress. You get your own side table, get your own wardrobe, desk and desk chair. And you walk in and every bedroom has its own bathroom and walk-in closet. So sink, toilet, bath shower combo. And it actually does indeed come with the shower rod. It does not come with the shower curtains though. And then you walk in through here and you can see you got a very, very spacious walk-in closet. What a lot of people do, and I did myself, was actually take this here wardrobe and it actually fits perfectly against right here in your closet. That way you have more space in your bedroom and you also can have all your clothes in one location. And also that's also cool because I know that I had my own furniture and I wanted a couple things in here and that just freed up a little bit more space. And I'll just briefly show you the other two bedrooms. They're identical, like I said, but it's just, they're just styled just a little bit differently. So you can kind of see what it would look like. Just briefly styled just a little bit differently. Still private bathroom and private walk-in closet. This one's my favorite. We got a nice little pug over here. Same, all the same, just style, just a little bit differently. Alrighty. And I did want to stress also that I'm pretty sure I've mentioned this before, but all of our leases are individual per bedroom. Um, that way you don't have to worry if your roommate or whoever you're living with isn't being able to pay the rent. So each, um, each bedroom is its own lease and you, you're not required to fill the unit. Basically, you sign your lease, we give you a spot, and then if you have a roommate in mind, then you, you roommate match with them and they'll be your roommate, or you can, we have another great roommate matching system that will pair you with people similar to you if you wanna go down that route. Which, I myself, I live with two of my roommates. Two of my roommates were my friends before, and then one of them is not, and honestly, he's not my best friend, but he's someone I'm able to live with, so. I do have pretty good faith in our roommate matching system. So now we're out here. I'll just give you a brief kind of look at the property and what we have. We're in our phase three of building. All of our units should be finished by the end of summer. Uh, right now we're just finishing up our townhomes, which is actually the last unit I'm gonna be able to show you today. Um, and I know that you weren't necessarily interested in a townhome, but what I do wanna stress, like I said, is our roommate matching. The townhomes are gonna be cheaper than the two bedroom, and they're also gonna provide you with more privacy and more space. And I know you had one other roommate in mind. It, that's totally great, you can live with her, and then you can roommate match with the other two, and then have your own personal space. And I think you're also just gonna like this place a whole lot better. I myself live in the D1, which I kinda wish I lived in the D2. There wasn't any D2 availables. Our D1 is our smaller four bedroom plan, and our D2, which is our other four bedroom is actually our townhouse. So what you see here, all the way over to that first brick, that door, this is all one apartment. So yeah, like I said, I know you're interested in a two bedroom, but I wouldn't scratch the four bedroom out yet because I think it has a lot more to offer and it's definitely more affordable as well. All righty. So you walk in here, now we're in our D2, our four bedroom plan. You have a separated living room. Furniture is a little bit different, TV stands just a teeny bit different. You still get the side table, coffee table, couch, love seat. Then you walk into here and you kind of have a dining room, kitchen mix. So the same table is included, the same four stools. Now instead of having the laundry uh, washer and dryer, the laundry room, right outside of a bedroom. It's actually downstairs, which is really nice as well. And another very nice feature about our townhouses is actually the, the bottom bedrooms have almost just a little patio. So you got your bike rack over here, got a little bit of green space, and your parking lot would just be right over there. So you can just walk in right into your apartment. Now here's the kitchen, just a little bit different setup. Instead of going on a straight line, it's in, a, it's in an L shape which I like as well. And there's also a window looking out, which is also really nice. 
So now here we're gonna go up the stairs. There's two bedrooms on the second floor and two bedrooms on the third floor. And they're almost identical to that of the bedrooms in the three bedroom, except the kitchen or the bathroom and the closet are separated. So you get a log again in these, you get a lot more natural light. You get windows on both sides. Same desk, chair, bed, wardrobe. And then over here, we have our walk-in closet. Separated from the bathroom, like I said. And then also your own private bathroom. Same size and everything. The only difference is it's separated. Like I said, Another bedroom directly over here, which I'm not going to show you because it's exactly the same as the other bedroom. But what I did want to show you is actually upstairs. We haven't decorated these bedrooms, so it just gives you an idea of exactly what you're going to get when you move in here. So mattress, which is with its own built-in mattress topper. Desk, dress chair, side table, wardrobe. bathroom and private closet another thing that I didn't mention earlier which is really nice about these townhouses is the second and third floor have these really big storage closets which actually the bed frames do fit in uh, I know that some people are very particular in the bed they sleep in so if you want to bring your own bed you can go ahead and store the one we gave you in there. That way you don't have to worry about it. So that concludes the tour of the townhouse, which I quite like a lot more, but it's always up to you. I'm gonna start heading back to the clubhouse now and kind of give you just a general idea of how close everything is. So right here, we're back to our clubhouse. People working in the office. All right. So anyways, that concludes uh, the tour. I just once again wanted to apologize. I understand that it seemed like I wasn't um, being aware of your schedule and I just really wanted to apologize for that again. I was very sick um, and I'm sorry that I didn't meet our date, but I hope that you did enjoy the tour. I hope that it gave you a better sense of the property and who we are. Um, I'm also gonna send an after tour breakdown over to you, which will go over all the rates, the specials and everything we're offering for you right now. So I hope you have a great rest of your day, Alexis. And I'm very sorry again that I did miss our tour. And I hope I can make it up to you. Alrighty, bye-bye.